I, uh, thank you. I'm, uh, thank you. I'm turning 32 in a couple of weeks, so I've decided to start taking dating seriously. It's time to grow up. No more messing around. No more drinking in the park. Time to do it. <laughs> Go on adult dates, nice places that have forks. Um, <laughs> I went out with someone recently. Uh, we went on the date and he ordered one drink all night. Here's my problem with that. Um, you are only order one drink, that means I can only have one drink. And if I only have one drink, how the hell am I supposed to want to touch you later, okay? <laughs> and he's sitting there like sipping it. Like, I was done with my vodka soda. I thought we were having a race. Like I didn't understand. And what bothers me about it, if I get introspective about it, what bothers me about it is that I wasn't okay with it, okay? I should have been an adult. I should have sat there and had normal girl thoughts and enjoyed my one drink and had normal girl on a date thoughts. Like, he seems really sweet. He's got nice eyes. I wonder what they look like in a jar. Like, normal, <laughs> normal. But not me, I'm sorry. I'm gonna be 32, not 92. I get a sip of liquor in me, it sends a message to my brain that it's go time. That's what happens. Immediately, yeah, you know. You get that alcohol in you, it goes through your bloodstream, to your brain, right to your party goblin. I don't know if you know how the human brain works. There is a cerebellum, a cerebral cortex, and a goblin that lives right here in the back. And she sleeps on a pile of rags and regrets. And she waits, she waits. And you drink the liquor, and it goes up your spinal column into your brain, and it wakes her up like <laughs> Vodka! To the megaphone! And she dictates your actions. We have all had a night dictated by our party goblin. It sounds something like this. You need to rage. Find the door guy. Ask him if he has drugs. Do not specify what kind. See what he comes up with. <laughs> Jump on top of that table. Start dancing. There is no music. I will provide the music. La, 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 la. Of course. <laughs> Jump off that table, run across the street, push that security guard, see if he finds it charming this week. Run into the bathroom, take a selfie, put it on Instagram, get it taken down 10 seconds later, cause hashtag free the nipple. Like that's what I wanna do. <laughs> on a weekend! No. Guys are listening, they're like, that sounds crazy. Girls have these crazy thoughts, okay? This is how we are. And sometimes we put those thoughts on you. Gentlemen, you should know that if you are ever vulnerable, in any way, shape, or form. The second we can sense that you want a relationship, the gender roles reverse. <laughs> and the man becomes the prey. <laughs> the man becomes the hunted. The man becomes like the lost, wide-eyed ingenue in a Disney enchanted forest. <laughs> and the girl becomes the hunter. The girl becomes like the creepy witch after your soul, yeah. You're sitting there at a bar, right? You're kind of lonely, like, man, tonight sucks. These fireball shots ain't gonna take themselves, whatever. <laughs> Wish, <laughs> wish I had a girlfriend. The second you admit that to the universe, a girl will appear out of nowhere like, Pff, Apple? <laughs> and then we begin saying all the things you need to be lured into a relationship. What's that? Sports? I love sports. This way. This way. Come this way, yes. What's that, what's that? Hobbies, I don't know, would love to watch uh, you and your, your friends play Xbox all day, yes! This way, come this way. Tell me, tell me all about your fantasy draft, yes! This way, what's that, a threesome? Brilliant idea, this way! <laughs> but gentlemen, you should know, once we have you, you are ours to do with what we please, okay? Sometimes we'll start a fight with you just for funsies. <laughs> Sometimes we'll start a fight with you just to see if we can make it seem like <sighs> you started the fight. <laughs> we must do this thrice yearly or we lose our standing in the girl club. All kinds of lies. What are you talking about? I don't want to fight with you. <laughs> I did not. Come here for a fight. Mm, I don't want to fight with you. We'll look at a fake jury. What is he even talking about? What is this? What are you talking about? I don't want to fight with you. But in your girl head, it's a very different monologue, isn't it? 
On the outside, I don't want to fight with you, but inside, <laughs> I want to fight with you. I woke up feeling chubby this morning. And that is somehow your fault. Get in the octagon. <laughs> We will tell you all kinds of, everything we say to you guys is a lie. You can be honest with me. Tell me if I look that lie to me, but buy me cakes. I don't care about Valentine's Day. It's the holiest day of the year. I'm not flirting with your friends. I want to bang your friend Scott. Everything's a lie. <laughs> and the biggest lie, the lie that every single woman in this room has said to her boyfriend without realizing it is this. What? Go hang out with your friends. It's fine. What? Go. No, go. Do it. I dare you. <laughs> what? Go. Go hang out with your friends. No, I'm serious. Go. Because I want you to be happy. Ooh. <sighs> what? No, go. It's fine. Seriously, do it. Go. Go. Go hang out with your There are no friends! <laughs> Thank you. <laughs>